Ladies, babies, guys and gals, all of our lovely, friendly pals, it's time. We've been waiting for this moment for probably for seven years, eight decade? years. Yeah. How, however yeah. long we've been doing mostly walking, it is the day years. where we are playing a game made by one of our hosts. And today, Lee Grainer. I had help. I had help. Lee yeah. Grainer <laughs> developed a game known as The Return to Monkey Island. Oh, so, yeah. you know, so fucking hyped. It's a good this. game. Now, wait, very, wait, wait, what did you, oh, did you click? I did the credits. Exciting. We're going to do yes. this right now. No, we just oh, finished yeah. the game. Yeah. I know. This is designed by Ron Gilbert and Dave Grossman that occasionally so I sort of port manteau Gilbert's into Dan Gilman for some reason. Dan Gilman. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, those artists are so good. The art is so good. And the animation. Yeah. incredible. There's, like, please note how many animations each character has in this because yeah. they're so good. And then the music is so tight. Uh, Sarah Thomas made amazing storyboards. Yeah. Um, I'm excited about all of that. Yeah, and then like the music. Is, oh, like the music. Lee Grader, Lee Grader's game programmer. Yeah, fuck yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's that's us. Oh, yeah. That's the pro 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 gamer programmers. Amazing. Um, yeah, and then they made the engine while we built with it, and yeah. Jen produced it, produced it all, and then Tina produced the rest of it. <laughs> <laughs> and produced the in between things. Oh yeah. It's look, too many to go by, but... Look how few testers. Look how few people were in this look game. Additional that. writing. Look look writer. Additional writer. You're Additional writer. Yeah. You're welcome. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hell oh, yes. Yeah. yeah. I wrote for Godbrush, motherfuckers. I wrote some Godbrush. I fucking love it. Yeah. Leebrush. <laughs> Lee oh, look at this. Amazing. Look at that cast. Look at, that. Look at this cast. Amazing. There are more people in the cast than worked on the game. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. It's a whoa! It's an incredible cast of. Uh, and then Neil Druckmann characters. was in this. <laughs> <laughs> wait, what is Neil? Yeah, wait. I, I think Neil Druckmann literally uh, just like uh, you know sends in a little fruit fly that just lands and just like puts his name in there. Yep, yeah. yep, that sounds right. I cannot keep up with how sick this all is. I'm this like, is the chat is just going wild for me. Like, this is like. Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> I know this is a big moment as far as checking things out. Greece. Oh, interesting. Oh, look at all these different recording studios in different parts of the world. Oh, that's man, how we that's work wild. now. That's how we work now. That is a lot of production difficulty. Like, as much as yeah. people like working from home, producers yeah. need to do three times as much work. And everyone else yeah. is kicking it. <laughs> that makes sense. I do want to say one thing, which is uh, I, I do know that I'm like not supposed to do quote unquote interviews about this project. So I will provide nothing. I will provide. I will give you nothing. I hope you're okay. hungry for nothing. I will give you no behind the scenes. Anything. <laughs> okay. OK, well, in, in that case, there, there's a question that I've been wanting to ask you that I've been waiting for a really long time. And I, I'm going to say this. And I think I want to be clear that an appropriate answer is nothing, okay? Sure, sure. <clears throat> Which is, um, somehow Lee kept this utterly private from Sean and yeah. I for, what was it, two, two and a half years? Uh, two years, I think. Yeah. yeah. Or really no, impressive. it was one, it was like 1.85 years, roughly. Well, yeah, oops. Yeah, because like, w one of the things about us, like we know what everyone does, but there's times when we're doing the show to get away from work. So before we're gonna go yeah. live, I'm like, oh, hey, how are things going? How's work? And it's like, dude, it's just going, let's play some games, right? And it's, it's we talk about so much stupid yeah. shit, it's so easy for us to just let that slip by. Yeah. yeah. There were a few times yeah. during that 1.85 years when I was just like, yeah, so like, you know, what, what are you doing now? You're like, look, I'm just, I'm just doing some work. I just wanna focus on doing this stuff. I'm trying to like, unmesh streaming and working and I'm like god boy do I feel that wow yeah. and then of course being the yeah. socially unaware jerk I was like well yeah that reminds me of a story about me and then I yeah, start talking right. fuck well, I gotta do, yeah. <laughs> I'm incredibly easy uh, to misdirect but, and I, so, but I will also oh go ahead Please. but so, so I, I want to know how you even got to work on this project because I mean there wasn't a job posting oh, I don't think um are you allowed to talk about that yeah is that a story while I eat my tofu stir fry? Yeah, I mean, I could give you the very basics because it is interesting. Um, I know that it was tricky to hire people for this because it was secret, and I'm sure that happens a mm -hmm. lot. But like, I basically got 
the like I heard about it. I heard about the job from someone else. So it was like I got the job listing through a person. So that means you need to go make some friends if you want jobs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. I guess if you want confidential work, yeah. You got to I guess just Hey, James Wall. Community? Did you interact with James Wall? I met James Wall when he was at Blizzard. He rules. Oh. Holy oh, shit. Cool. Oh. Um yeah, so it's tricky. And also like the you know, the job listing didn't say what game it was. Uh Right, sure. Um, um, but yeah, you definitely need to like put in your work to like increase your Dieseltrons so that you have maximum, uh, not synchronicity, what's the serendipity, maximum serendipity powers. Um, yeah. Kismet. In other words, you know what it is, Sean? In other words, I got, I got fucking lucky. <laughs> right. Locked in. <laughs> I, I, I actually. I, I, same as how I got this show, Sean. <laughs> You know, I, somebody I, I, gave it to me. I actually think, I think, Lee, I actually think it's all skill. I think that I think in this is. in this yeah. world that is utter randomness, you're just looking to ride the waves when they show up, and a lot of waves yeah. want to lap up on your beaches, Lee. They want to uh, lap there because of my charisma. <laughs> it, welcome to Charisma Beach. Um, actually, Charisma Beach sounds really good. I'm gonna charisma I'm gonna Beach dial down my good. ambient. So that you can see the back of my, because right now I have sort of a. So I'll be right back. Okay. Oh. Um, I'll just put that in. All right. This is. Oh, this. This is where Lee stands up, walks away, and is wearing no pants. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, well, there <laughs> goes <laughs> my <laughs> my channel. Light. Like how? Oh yeah. So so uh, Lee, should we new game or should we scrapbook it? Let's scrapbook it. Yeah. I yeah yeah yeah. The scrapbook is so tight. Scrapbook. It's um, filled with my adventures. I'm not hearing the wait. Is I this hear my it fault? Very Yeah, softly. I have to watch the screen. Yeah, well, here let me let me crank it up a little bit. Here we go. It's it's, it's going to be quite loud now. Sweet. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to be a mighty pirate. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh. I like it. Oh yeah. Interactive. It's interactive. Yeah. Um, That's me, Guybrush Threepwood. That's me, <laughs> Guybrush Threepwood. <laughs> In the old days, oh. you became a pirate by completing three trials to prove your worth. Oh, yeah. Treasure hunting is important for any pirate. Oh, my gosh. I forgot about the insult spark. Mastering Did sword you? fighting that's was more the, a matter of wits That's the highlight agility. for me of that game. This is when I met Elaine, the love of my life. She was governor at the time. The <laughs> pirate leaders were in charge of the three trials, acting as judge, jury, executioner, and devoted grog tasters. The test of thievery involved breaking into the governor's mansion. The security was heavy. Ooh. Things took an unexpected turn while I was working on the three trials. Elaine was kidnapped and taken to Monkey Island by the nefarious ghost pirate LeChuck. Oh, I hate LeChuck. I He's scraped such a together a crew. Oh. Carla, Otis, and Meat Hook joined me on my voyage to Monkey Island to save Elaine. Okay, already. All right, hold on. I'm going to crank it down just a little bit. Ju just a skosh. But, like, already? Yeah. This is so charming. Right? Like, can we just... Oh, totally. Oh, like, the art. Can we just get a... Can we just get a shout-out for, like, the art and animation and sound? Oh, it's so I good. love it. And voice acting and writing. Yeah, like, okay, the, the, there's this... One of the things that just always... It doesn't hurt me, but I just always feel a little disappointed when there's a game that has all the elements there. But it's like so many of the elements had to be built first and didn't have any time to get polished and integrated later. Like, yeah. Like this could have been a single piece of concept art with narration. But instead, mm -hmm. each of these images thoughtfully made. And if if I'm like going through this and I'm like, you became oh, I remember this. I can skip it if I want to. Mm -hmm. turn while I was mm -hmm. working on the three trials, I scraped together a crew. Carla, Otis, and Meat Hook joined me on my voyage to Monkey Island to that. save Elaine. I scraped um. together a crew. thought he was in love with Elaine. My first ship was the Sea Monkey. I bought it at Stan's used ships with a letter of credit that I um, sort of falsified. My first ship was the Sea Monkey. Oh. Monkey Island was a steaming volcanic mystery, covered with jungle and not found on any map. You were going to say, Lee? I think um, one thing to keep your eye out for is that 
certainly for the project creators and, 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 and lead, leads of it, but also for so many of us on the team, I think you'll get the sense that the world of Monkey Island is like felt very real to us, you know? So like, therefore it became very easy for us to create things that feel placed in a real world. And, and I don't just pay attention to that as you go, yeah, you know? This is where I want to give a shout out to game writers because mm -hmm. game writing is very minimally about the dialogue. Like the dialogue is there, but living underneath it is just wealth of like, what's the world and the lore and- Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's know. David. D David Fox is uh, was my, my uh, engineering, I guess, I guess boss, that sounds weird, but um, <laughs> head of head of eng. Engineering captain. Amazing. Welcome. Welcome. On the island was a gigantic monkey head statue with hidden catacombs underneath. You had to brew a special potion just to find Monkey Island. I made some substitutions, but it got us there just the same. You had to brew a... There were some people living there who claimed to be cannibals, but I think it was just a show for the tourists. Oh, yeah. LeChuck's <laughs> ghostly ship was anchored in a lake of lava hidden beneath the Classic. island's surface. The monkey head opened with a special key that you stuck in its ear. Ugh. I met an old castaway there, Herman Toothrot. He and the locals wrote a lot of indignant letters to each other. We wound oh, up yeah. back on Melee Island for the stunning conclusion to my first big adventure. I made it to the church just in time to stop the wedding. Or so I thought. It turned out Elaine already had everything under control. How does she do that? By then, I had learned that ghosts like LeChuck are vulnerable to root beer. It just trust me, it works, okay? okay. It was the beginning of something <laughs> magical. Now, Lee, should we should we go through the entire thing? Because I know that there's many um, Monkey Island games that have existed. Oh, what if we? Uh, how about this? What if we? Uh, the treasure of Big Whoop. We can. How about this? For now, let's start the this brand new adventure, and then, you know, that scrapbook All will right. always be there for us to return to. We, so. we can come back to. Now, some of the things that I did do <coughs> is uh, all the volume is the normal. Uh, with yeah. video, I have everything maxed out. So that way okay, we can sweet. just see the finest, highest quality. Are you sure you can, your computer Hells, can? Yeah. Now, I do want to say, go to text and language or something. Yeah, okay, so I, I put display speaker's name on oh. and just oh, left everything okay. else alone. And then under text and languages, I have text and speech on there. Now, do you want the writer's cut? I think you probably do. More blather, worse pacing? Yeah, mm. it's just more more words per for your money, you know? I, I I'm going to recommend going for the default one. Go for the default setting. Well, brutal for for <laughs> brutal. Oh yeah, obliterated. I, for the show, if I was playing this on my own, I would yeah. definitely turn that on. Yeah, sure. But for the show, yeah, 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 that's right. So we're gonna have those sound effects subtitles. I'm I'm into that. Yeah. Oh hell you yeah. You don't need like your you too. don't need your edition extended. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. There's <laughs> casual mode and hard mode. Definitely do hard mode. Definitely do hard mode. Oh yeah. And then of course we're going to do I can never talk you there's, guys out of doing hard there's mode. More, oh, there's, there's, yeah. there's more in hard. Hard mode is Excuse me. I mean, in my like single player a, adventure yeah. games, Sean, I need to win, okay? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is about proving my gaming prowess. And I like that it's casual for the busy on the go player. <laughs> True. <laughs> If I am perhaps running to an elevator whilst holding a baby, I may enjoy the casual mode. Yes. Hard mode, more puzzles. I mean, hard, puzzles. hard mode, you know, hard mode mostly means there's uh, more um, errands you have to run, I think. Mm. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Love errands. That's, oh, yeah. I, I mean, that's the whole point, right? Oh, yeah. Life is mostly about picking things up, moving them, and putting them down again. Take this, LeChuck! Uh, Boy brush! Brush, come over here. Gently now. Remove my you mask. You do remember the end of Will Monkey Island 2, don't you? Will you promise to stop picking on me? All yes. right, all right, I promise. I do. Anything. Just put my leg back on. Hey, you kids. You're not supposed to be in here. <laughs> I don't remember the name Boy Brush. I don't remember two. that being canonical, but parents. it is amazing. Yeah. Oh, this is incredible. You were probably worried about murderers and ne'er-do-wells. Don't worry. I found him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Um, come on. Let's go. Let's pretend I have powers that make lightning come out of my eyes. It's so... Oh, yeah, Squawk! Like. 
Yeah, look at that. What is real? <laughs> that's, that's an amazing uh, <laughs> subtitle. Like, right? Sound effect, visual effect. Sorry, boys. It took Could the artist following us it's so creepy. long to cut out all these things out of paper. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Sean. <laughs> wow. I did it. <laughs> All right. I am going to... Uh, where is the... I want to remove the speaker's name because it's completely clear who's talking. Right? Yeah. Here. No, that's good. All right. Oh, so if God. I hit T, buy scurvy dogs. Junior Mighty Pirates to do list. <laughs> Amazing. Here's my inventory, which I assume is here as well. This is... Menu. All right. Island's right. oh, got a scurvy dog that was bigger than my head. Oh my God! Look, look at how you get tinier. Yeah. When you go backwards. So, so. It's oh my gosh. Good. It, it, it's so amazing that like <laughs> the amount of quality of life things uh -oh. that this 2022 game did to improve upon the early 90s point click adventure game genre is really nice. Um, Cause you're so you're talking about the scaling of the characters, right? Yeah. Because some places you go have scurvy dogs. With I mean, cheese inside. Yeah. Just pay attention throughout the game to maybe how the spaces are not uh, Euclideanly geometric, mm. and then consider what someone might have to do to make it look good <laughs> to have the characters scale in bizarre non, non Euclidean yeah, yeah. space. Yeah, because you know, what you're talking about is exactly where I was going, which is that, I mean, in terms of visuals, this... I once had the hiccups for four days straight. Do they get quieter when they're in the background? What should we do uh, next? Yeah, gotta get to I think so. I can't Anyways, believe you never I'm not going to weigh one. in on that one. I don't know. But, but like, in, in some games... There was a huge issue where if they shrunk the sprite, your velocity and the animations and everything in the world was proportional to that size. So, yep. uh, Sean Bloom and I you can keep a mm -hmm. dog warm, played King's Quest Seven, where when you walked back here, you would move like this quickly. What should we do next? Yeah. Right. I think it was the opposite, Sean. If I remember that correctly. Oh, when that may have been right. Yeah. It didn't scale the velocity, so when you got really far away, you had this tiny little key. character that it was, was fucking booking it. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, uh, Chucky, stand over here for a minute. Nah, I want to get scurvy dogs. Exhibit removed. Aww. Chucky has good ideas. Dude, by the way, this 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 is some restraint, right? Exhibit removed. It's it like and the characters went ah. Oh. If I were working on this game, I would have a quip for every single thing, and you'd be tired of the game in five minutes. Much like oh, my content on yeah. weekdays. Wait a minute, exhibit removed. Oh, interesting. Yeah. That's. Let's not go back there again. Yeah. We'll just get yelled at. Yeah. Let's get scurvy dogs instead. Uh, oh, and I can double click to bolt? Hell yeah, get some scurvy dogs. Oh, you already figured that out. Excuse me, Lee. There's a reason I play these on hard mode. Let's try. I mean, this this art is I fucking like divine. Oh my god! At the same time. <laughs> yeah, uh, David, I don't I don't know what we can and can't talk about, so I'm just I'm only talking about what's literally on the screen in front of us. Oh, look at this! You never even need to learn the controls. You just hover over stuff and it tells you what to do. I mean, you kids yeah, better have right? money. Isn't that yeah, like, no, I like really that nice? We've got it's really nice. Money. Can we get a couple of scurvy dogs? Sure. If you give me a piece of eight, that's money that grown-ups use. I know what a piece <laughs> of eight is. Good for you. You can have a couple of dogs if you give me one. Please? Can't you spare something for a couple of hungry kids? Oh, <laughs> so unnecessary. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I don't like kids. I'm an honest businessman trying to make an honest living. I don't need 50 kids a day coming in and wasting my time trying to get me to give them free food. I guess never mind. I guess never mind. The never animation mind. style I is know. like Let's look for really smooth. The way. It's got a quality yeah. to it that I love. Pockets when they sit down in there. 
So, so this animation style, it, it, I believe, is called paper dolling, where basically I you. The in the back. I can feel it with my tongue. Uh oh, he's getting MS Paint. Oh Jesus! Oh shit! Where like, it, it's a really efficient way to do animation, where yeah. you, where you literally, mm -hmm. in the same way that you would use with like a paper doll, where you'd punch a hole right here, and then you have like an arm sticking off, mm -hmm. and this, this, yeah. this is a big arm. This uh, joint right here would allow the piece of paper to swivel back and forth. This is a, a really easy and common way that animation is done in 2D. This was really common if you, you play Flash games. Look at, the, look at the length of these arms, man. What does this guy mean? Look at this gangler. <laughs> yeah, this is, I don't even know what this is think, anymore. But like, uh, Oh, yeah. Go, go on. But like th this is very simple, so it's easy to make something there. Mm. What when you get more talented artists and more budget, there's an intuition of like, well, let's just go full 3D. Let's like try to amp up the fidelity of the model and all this stuff. And I love whenever there's a style like this, where this is like that elevated times a billion. Like look at the yeah. way the hair moves. I do think- It has like little shader wiggles. I do think um, this uses, yeah, this uses rigs though. So it's it's 2D, but it's, it's using spine, which I think oh, you yeah. know by the credits. <laughs> But yeah, so it does use it does use bones. Um, you know it's not exactly paper doll. If you don't wash them. Yeah, but but like the it it looks like that paper doll style, but right. it's like just cranked up to eleven. It's so good. Like like yeah. look, look at the feet. They're facing this way. When I click this way, one face is this way. Yeah. Like like you don't need to do that. That's unnecessary polish, and I love nothing if not a necessary polish. Yeah. You should have told us that half a year ago. <laughs> I've got a collection of old scurvy dog sticks that fills a whole shoebox. Looks like they need a swabby in here. I'll never be the ship swabby. That is really, really low. They put it on a leg to keep you from walking uh. off with it. I'll bring this right back, sir. You'd be wise to do that. I got the leg from the last kid who didn't bring back the key. <laughs> All right, so there's scurvy dogs. Order a grog. I once got. How much is a mug of grog? Grogs for grown. Can we get a mug of grog, please? I told you. All right, so we need to get these scurvy dogs, man. And I assume that if I unlock here, it's locked. Good thing I've got the key in my pocket. Oh, you're gonna make me take it out? Hell yeah. Did you know you can keep good? You unlocked it. Did you know good? <laughs> I think interrupting I would say this interrupting the text of an adventure game by doing something I uh, had the hiccups for four something days. useful is 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 a continual joy <laughs> it isn't a piece of eight but it's a round piece of metal about the same size and shape as a piece of eight that's called a slug it's like a fake coin a fake coin is almost as good as a real coin Fake coin is almost as good as a Bitcoin. Um. <laughs> Chucky, why don't you look in the toilet? No way. You do it. Okay. <laughs> like, Gross. all Gross. I have done is taken a key. I want to two scurvy dogs at Quiet. the same time. What if I hit this? Can I? Nice. I can mute it just like that. Um, like, I so love. The fact that we've just kind of wandered around and clicked on things, and there's been like three little like zoom ins, maybe four actually, of just like expressions. Yes. Oh. Uh, yeah. What is like, this stuff? Please wash hands before it's, leaving um, the house. I'm not touching that. I mean, is there a name for that it's animation like style? It's like a Ren and Stimpy sort of. Uh, I don't know. Cutting. Yeah, like the hyper, hyper, hyper detailed. Yeah. Um. I am a huge fan, but I'm not sure what you would call it. I always I associate what it with Ren and with Stimpy, this? but I recently was yeah. reading something written by a younger person uh, who tastes like a piece of eight. Different shit. Enough for a couple of scurvy dogs, if you want. SpongeBob. Perfect. Yes, I think it was SpongeBob. Take them, boy. What are you getting? What? Just kidding. Here's yours. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, this was very early Nickelodeon, <laughs> with like hair and I'm happy for breakfast and snot. Dinner forever. What do you want to do now? I don't know. 
What do you want to do? Mess around and explore. Find our real parents. <laughs> yeah, no, this I I think we've all been in this to-do list every once in a while. I love how there's jokes in this game that I haven't seen yet, because they're like hidden in like the to-do list and stuff. Yeah. Hey, Chucky, get ready to run. I guess they don't like visitors. Alright. Sounds real. All right, I'm going. Oh my God, we have another part of the screen. Let's go that way go now. Right. That's my friend D. It. Hey D. Hey Chucky, what are you jerk faces up to? We just got here. I'm making a list of stuff to do. Give me that. I'm an expert planner. Like you don't need to do that. You don't need to show that. I, close incredible, up. incredible. There, perfect. See you around <laughs> the park, sitheads. Ugh. <laughs> Check out the anchor, beat Chucky in a race, feed the duck, add some sauce to my scurvy dog, practice sword fighting, find a four-leaf clover, make a wish with the wishing well. Find our real parents. Yeah. Alright, I don't want to find my parents, I have some ducks to feed. <laughs> hey Chucky, wanna race? You're on. I'll officiate. Three, two, one, go! I clicked! I win! Damn! <laughs> You, but but Sean, you double clicked. I did. I clicked like a hundred times. Because if you don't, if you double click, click, then you lose. You lose. Amazing. Yeah. Oh, education. It's education. That's right. It's edutainment. Edutainment. That's a cool anchor. <sighs> that just shows how little you know about anchors. This one's not a very good example. <laughs> You'd know that if you read as much about anchors as I have. <laughs> Did you know that anchors originally weren't designed to hold ships in place? They were used in combat, shot from cannons as a grapple when they were trying to board another ship. They started making. Oh my god, this is so good. They would do more damage that way. Why would you ever want to skip through this? You can still on a modern that's to prevent a little most anchors about. Oh my god. Good, right? <laughs> <laughs> ah, I see. Amazing. Sick. Incredible. That is a very cool feature. I wonder where this path goes. Hopscotch. Wait. David says all the anchor facts are made up? But I thought I... Oh, all the I've anchor facts are made up? Those. That's so good. I've been telling people those oh. facts. Uh, those are 100% made up. <laughs> those are not real facts. <laughs> Alright, so... Excuse me. Yes? Could we have some of your bread to feed the duck? I don't think so. We brought it for ourselves. <laughs> Alright, is this where it zooms in and I play Untitled Goose Game? That's our yeah. bread. Kick her into the pond. Excuse me. Yes? <laughs> Will you pretend to be our parents again? What do you mean, again? Run along and find your real parents. Don't feed the duck. What's this red glob on the ground? That's ketchup. It's supposed to be really good with oh, scurvy no. dogs. No. You should no. put that on your scurvy dog. No. All right. I wonder where this path goes. All right, well, I did it. Good ideas. And some sauce to my scurvy dog, great. Right? Let's be frank. You can never hope to beat me. No way. You'll never catch up to my level. I win. I win. Uh -uh. <laughs> you guys are both pretty weak. <laughs> uh, anyway, that was fun. Did I do it? Oh, hell oh, yeah. yeah. So we gotta feed this stuff. <clears throat> I saw a sign that had a four leaf clover on it. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, look at this. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Here we go. I do not pick the four leaf clovers. <laughs> As if. Let's look for a four leaf clover. <laughs> okay. Good luck with that. 
Wait, how did you do that? Awesome. There was still one left. Damn. Wait. 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 What do you mean? It was. It was the four leaf one. Oh. Okay. I mean, it has four I leaves. I thought that was another opportunity to learn something, but apparently I mean, you don't need to learn. I think it was an opportunity for everyone watching to learn something about how good I am at single-player, <laughs> competitive, <laughs> professional gaming games. <laughs> Alright. Amazing. So wishing well. We find a coin to throw in. Where did give away our coin? Oh, did you? I mean, by giveaway, oh, I mean yeah. bought something here? with it. We might not be able to come back if we had this. Wait, how do you? Oh, oh, it's our dad. Hey, dad. Hello, Mr. Threepwood. Hey, kids. Having fun? Yeah. We got scurvy dogs. Those have toenails and stuff in them. Ugh, I read about it. And we were playing your adventures. We just did big whoop. Big whoop. Oh boy. That takes me back. I like it when Chucky asked me to put his leg back on. He says it really funny. You guys always make up the craziest stuff for the ending of that story. It's fun. <laughs> but you can't just change it around. That's not how storytelling works. A lot of your stories don't feel like they're finished at the end. What do you mean? Well, like, there's this one that you call The Secret of Monkey Island, where you went to Monkey Island and fought LeChuck. Oh, that story has a great ending. There's punching and fireworks. I thought you liked that one. But you never did find the secret. Not the real one. Sure, but that's not what that story was about. Kids, let me tell you a story that is about finding the secret of Monkey Island. Is I'm ready. Is a long yeah. story? All right. I think maybe I gotta go use the bathroom or something. Yeah, I have to go uh, walk my tarantula. Maybe I should go with them. No, no, stick around. This is a good one. See, there was a rumor going around that my old nemesis, LeChuck, had somehow discovered the exact location of the secret of Monkey Island. I knew I had to get it before he did, so I went to Melee to get my own expedition started and beat him to the punch. You ready? This is Ooh. Hold on to your butts, yeah. Oh my god, it's the island! No! Yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Oh my god, fuck yeah. Looks really good. Oh my god, yes. Yes. Designed by the portmanteau Dan Gilman. <laughs> oh, it's so I good. I really like this track. The music yeah. is really good. Chris Gortz. Oh, yeah. Big fan of people with one syllable last names. Oh, there you are, hey. David. David, who's hey. in chat? Hey, David. Oh, Lee, you're back. Welcome back, hey. Lee. Hey, you're also in the chat, Lee. <laughs> I, I really appreciate how they like look at all these credits on the title screen. Yeah, like, I know. I know. Like, you, you, don't play the game. Stop. It's look at us. <laughs> We're real. And this is the second time I've seen the credits too, and it's great. Yeah. Look at us. Oh yeah, that's so good. <laughs> Matt. Yes, Matt Man W two. I did work on. <laughs> that is a. Uh, I hear that every day or so. Back on <laughs> Island, the hub of pirating in the Caribbean, where every good expedition begins. I'll see some old pals oh, and get so things good. rolling. Or Look at that campfire! Damn! Hi. Yeah, that's Street incredible. Board. Remember me? Look at, the Look at the color. Look at the color. What have you been up to? Yeah, well, you know, freebooting mostly, swashing buckles and so on. But now I'm getting an expedition together to find the secret of Monkey Island. Oh, you're sailing with LeChuck? What? The Chuck's here in Melee? Is there widespread panic? Are people evacuating? <laughs> ah, he doesn't seem interested in carnage at the moment. Ship's just here, taking on supplies and crew, as far as I can tell. 
Anyway, no, I'm not sailing with LeChuck. You know my history with him. I also like that little owl. Yeah. He's an evil zombie ghost pirate, terror of the seas, and sometimes the land. A nefarious, conniving, murdering scallywag. A depraved, ruthless villain. And a loud talker. And I'm not those things. They say opposites attract, but what do I know? I'm I'm I'm, I'm top to bottom here. Yeah, I know. I want to hear it. He's always had designs on her. I sailed to Monkey Island to find them and get her back. Oh, I thought you weren't married yet when that happened. And didn't she more or less rescue herself? <laughs> Not the point. All right. We've been enemies for my whole career. We've been enemies for my whole career. Everywhere I go, there he is. He plagues me. He's my nemesis. Funny. He said the same thing about you. So good. Oh, and by the way, for any new yeah. darlings that are joining us today, do not even think about spoiling or backseating. Oh if you are trying no. to suggest, oh, hey, I think there's a thing you can do over there. You got it. You're, you're banned forever. And uh, Twitch is deleting your account. And you're uninstalling Chrome. <gasps> that guy steals yep. all my best ideas. Are you sure it isn't the other way around? Seems like he was here first. I don't know how he found out, but I'm sure he's just doing this to get one up on me. I'm mounting my own voyage. <laughs> yes. Fine. Well, you'd better get cracking then. The Chuck's loading up on the outer dock as we speak. Well, I'm gonna hire a ship and a crew and beat him to the punch. Just as well, soon as I can spoiling. get someone to back the venture. I'm a little short on funds at the moment. Oh, do we do we get to go do <laughs> fundraising? You want to go talk to Hell the yeah. pirate leaders at the scum bar? <laughs> exactly. Pirate That's leaders. To melee. It'll be great to see those old guys again. We'll knock back a grog and hash out the details. Scumbar. Oh no, it's gonna go badly. Why, docks. Long table Why would you back. say that, Sean? <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. We'll see. <laughs> Oh my this god. This incredibly straightforward <laughs> from beginning to end. <laughs> I detect a certain resemblance here. Yes, it looks a lot like an owl, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't you be on your way to the scum bar to talk to the pirate leader? I was just about to head down there. Oh, thank you, Lord Eldrazi. <laughs> Are you like 10 10 for 10 colorless? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you have Annihilator 4, Lord Eldrazi? All right. Uh, oh my gosh. It is so weird to be back here with right? like unbelievably smooth fidelity. It's so yeah. smooth. I can't get over how smooth it is. It's pretty smooth, right? Goes down smooth. Oh, let's read this poster. <laughs> She's keen on bluntness. Governor <laughs> Carla. I'll talk to the pirate leaders before I go see what LeChuck is up to. I'll talk to the pirate leaders before I go see All what right. LeChuck is up I, to. Alright, I, I understand. Point well taken. Some things <laughs> never change. The scum bar will be here as long as there are pirates. Damn pirate wannabes. Alright, so looking around. This is it. Um, oh, I have one yeah. idea for you. I, I have one idea that you could try doing. Mm. Uh, you could talk to the pirate leaders. <laughs> Got it. Got it's, it. That's sort Got of it. out of the blue. <laughs> Got it. Got it. It's kind of a non sequitur. I'm here to talk to the pirate leaders about a new expedition. In the back. I'm here to um, talk to the pirate leaders about a new expedition. Yeah, Lee, the <laughs> dynamic lighting is is pretty remarkable. I mean, not Isn't it? <coughs> so much in this scene, but like the, a new uh, the glow coming from the door. I'm here to talk to the pirate yeah. leaders about a new expedition. Um, I'm here to talk to the pirate leaders about in the back. In the back. In the, in the back. Wait, I am actually going to backseat you for one, one quick thing. Yeah, please. Click on that red book there. Ah, it's a book that, for storing collectible trivia that's cards. That's fun. Looks like someone just left it here unattended. Oh. Oh, it's the kitchen. In the back of the scum bar is. Hell yeah. I remember video games. Oh my god. I didn't know you could win at a card. You, 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 <laughs> looks like a circus. Maybe. 
I think that's the, is that the first time I've ever spoiled or backseated anything in this? Is that the, this is the, probably the first time I've ever contributed to progress in this, in this show? <laughs> <laughs> listen to the music. Listen to the music. Yeah, no. Listen when I walk this way. Yeah. This. Oh my god, dude! This was my favorite part of Banjo Kazooie, man. <laughs> where it just so good. It just yeah. faded the instrumentation. Nice and hot. I wonder how long I could stand here before bursting into flames. <laughs> Have you seen the pirate leaders around? This is their table. In fact, you'd probably better move. You don't want to get caught sitting here. It's our table, Rummy. We're the pirate leaders. Get lost. I haven't heard there was a change in I leadership. There was a change of leadership. Oh no. Did nobody remember to notify you? Maybe your party invite got lost in the mail. All right. Where are the three older guys who used to hold court here? Where are the three older guys who used to hold court here? Who cares? Probably crying in an alley somewhere, wishing they were still relevant. <laughs> Making up trials for each other and writing memoirs that no one will read. <laughs> Dude, like the the, it's so unnecessary. The mouth animations and the subtlety of the animations of every character. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. The. The whole game is lip synced. Uh, it's it's insane. Is it yeah, who I should no. talk to about financing an expedition? An expedition. Who is it that you think you are exactly? I'm Guybrush Threepwood. I'm Guybrush Threepwood. Sure. Probably you've heard of me. Probably Famous. not. Permission to slaughter the annoying old wastrel man, Captain Madison. Oh, <laughs> Wait, look at that. Was Captain Madison? She's like. I've got her on a trading card. Her plunder stats are amazing. Plunder stats aren't everything. Then the others were Captain Lila and Captain Trent. It was Lila who threatened to kill you? Look, they weren't that great, okay? <laughs> Listen to the story. Want me to slaughter him? <laughs> Don't bother. He's just a harmless hack who thinks he has a good idea for a pirate raid. Uh, it's not... No, I'm going to find the secret of Monkey Island. Yeah, hell yeah. I love... Let me tell you. I started Cuts watching I started watching this thriller series called Giri Haji that wow. is about um, a gang war in, in Tokyo that's going to break out unless uh, a Japanese police detective goes to London to try to find his brother that he thinks is the one that started it because his brother's supposed to be dead okay. and this show okay. is so weird because characters just share information with each other logically and frequently <laughs> and they make logical decisions. Weird. It's weird, because normally it's just like the detective would go there and be like, I can't tell anyone I'm looking for my brother. But the very first thing that he has the slightest bit of trust with someone who says, what are you doing here? He's like, I'm looking for my brother. <laughs> and, and I'm just like, whoa, what a twist to actually say what's happening. So like, I'm, I'm going to go down Giri Haji route and just say, I'm going to find the secret I'm of Monkey Island. find the secret of Monkey Island. You're wasting our time. The secret? I didn't think that was even a real thing. Uh, <laughs> it's a personal <laughs> passion of mine. I really want to find it. Yeah, that's it's that's a, a good way to get investment. I really want to find it. Your weird fetishes are not something I need to hear about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sensing some reluctance, but hear me out. All right, now, now, um, you know, yeah. all three of us have done a mix of um, fundraising, grant seeking, basically groveling for some uh, sure. funding for a project. And sure. right now, it has one to one matched every experience I've ever had. And I'm curious how <laughs> things are going to go as we. Would you at least consider yeah. advancing me some funds? Would you at least consider advancing me some funds? It's a surefire investment. Triple your money or your money back. Not interested. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Triple your money or your money back. I could make it worth your while to help me. I could make it worth your while to help me hire a crew. <laughs> the percentage of their earnings or something. No one in here wants to chase your pipe dream. Yep, that's that's pitching and entertainment. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, this mm -hmm. isn't about making something people will enjoy. We're a business. <laughs> We're trying to make money. 
Well, wouldn't you say that making an enjoyable product would cause people to buy it? Oh, not in business, dummy. It's so good. Gee, Sean, are you? Please point me towards an available ship. <laughs> so, you don't like even have a ship. You're Doesn't really sound so theoretical. Up a creek. Up a creek without a ship. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, here it comes. Here it comes. We're not going to be first to market. If you don't take this opportunity, LeChuck will grab it. LeChuck? Yes, the dreaded zombie ghost pirate LeChuck himself is also going after the secret. He's here in Melee getting ready right now. If that doesn't prove it's a worthwhile venture, I don't know what else to tell you. Great. Problem solved. Excellent. You'll do it. Huh. No, of course not. Damn it. Why waste money on an expedition when you can just join the one that's already going? Have fun with your scary ghost friend. Bye-bye. Well, the slight problem with that idea is that LeChuck and I are basically mortal enemies. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, these close-ups. They're so good. <laughs> I don't need you or your money. I can do this on my own. If I can't buy a ship, I'll steal one. I'm a pirate. I'll find a way to get to Monkey Island no matter what it takes. I like the old pirate leaders better. Well, it, it, the truth is that when you get rejected for your project, people are normally very polite. But then when you go home, or when you're in the car driving home, this is what you imagine that it feels like. <laughs> and they yeah. were laughing at me, and they told me to do it myself, and I was like, fine. <laughs> it's true. Oh my god, the nostalgia. Right? Brush. Wait, are you going to tell a mushy part now? A little, but I can skip over the hugs and kisses. Elaine! Guybrush! Let me tell you, as a romance fiend, I want the hugs and kisses. But before the hugs and kisses, no. oh. well, I need tension. You know, there needs to be something driving you them apart. Turn off the, you turned off the writer's cut. I'm just kidding. <laughs> that, doesn't add, that doesn't add up more hugs and kisses. That's DLC, I think. Oh, yeah, there we go. I was hoping you'd turn up in this story. Monkey I Island date night. You'd turn up in mine. How's your scurvy prevention project? It's great! We're going to get a lot of limes to a lot of sailors and save a lot of lives. I've got to come up with a way to deal with Captain Madison, though. The pressure she's putting on the town is making it hard for social programs like mine. God, it, like, like, it, it... These are 3D models. Well, you can tell when they like turn, it's like a little uh, parallax-ish kind of thing. They are not 3D models. They are oh. incredibly well done 2D characters. And but done probably, by amazing magical artists. Yeah, but and probably, animators. Like, I guess there's like there's like 2D elements that when they turn their head, they like, you know, parallax a little bit. Oh, it's mm -hmm. so good. You mm -hmm. wouldn't happen to have a ship with you. No, silly. Look at the nose. I came on a charter. Yeah. Just See how you. it turns? Yeah, oh, I figured that. Totally. It never hurts yeah. to ask. I'm finding yep. it harder than I thought to get hold of a ship. I've crew I've worked with people who did that. The new local leadership like, was less than uh, supportive. Why Parallax don't you ask 2D around at the docks? Faces. Sure, you can find it's something. It's very cool. Thanks. It's very, I'll very try cool. that. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's 2D. It's 2D, but it's with bones. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Sounds like you both met Captain uh, Madison. Sounds like we both met Captain Madison. I don't like her. She's the one who pushed to shut down the shipyard. She doesn't understand the value of the secret of Monkey Island. She laughed at me. Me too. Obviously, the woman has no taste and a lousy sense of humor. You've probably got to get going. You say goodbye first. <laughs> no, you say bye first. No, oh, you say bye first. No, you say bye first. I'm gonna, I'm escalating. Oh, you say bye first. No, you say bye first. Okay. Oh, I always <laughs> win! The champion of point-and-click adventure games is here! Alright, awesome. What does this notice say? It's Elaine's flyer about how limes combat scurvy. It's important, but boring. I've never once made it all the way to the end. <laughs> it's important, but boring. The obstacle to all education. Oh, yeah. The problem with this statue is it's not a statue of Elaine, the best-ever governor of Melee. 
<laughs> it doesn't look finished. Real voodoo going out. I of think take the take the flyer. It. Oh, thank you. Elaine would kill me if she caught me pulling oh, down. Oh, never mind. Flyers. Don't take the flyer. Yeah. Don't do, do you want to get me killed? I don't. Dude, just like look, look, look in the background. Just the subtle little. Oh my god. Oh. That's so good. I mean, like, nothing yeah. really moves like this. <laughs> like, this is not but realistic, but like this, I love that sort of stylization. Yeah. It's also, I mean, this is such a nostalgia bomb. Like this. It's like Wally's yeah. got a new place in Melee. I hope he's not still yeah. sore about the monocle. This screen. At Chamber of Commerce Midnight Luncheon. Back shortly. <laughs> so, I, I will say there's a lot of jokes of uh, midnight I think back short did come about as part of just like chat, like team, the team <laughs> chatting about things. <laughs> uh huh. Because I think there was a luncheon. I think the luncheon was not originally a midnight luncheon. I think it was just, you know, it's always night on Melee. So, right. oh. at some point, someone noticed that. This place has kind of gone downhill. I Elaine really like that for this joke in the what kind of person would just paint on a wall like like that? in the the text tips in the like oh graffiti here graffiti there graffiti everywhere oh yes like a very... been broken for decades now <clears throat> yeah like graffiti here graffiti there graffiti everywhere like this oh my god dude very unnecessary clever. polish undeniable quality those like, yeah oh. writing um. I don't know. I, I don't think I want to like. I don't think I want to like say which rooms I wrote and which one I didn't because that would spiral into a weird narcissistic thing. But um, if any it's clock were the exception to that rule, it would be this one. It's like really fun if any to like write those because like when we were working on the rooms, like a lot of the times we got to like add that sort of stuff as we mm -hmm. went, mm -hmm. which was like really fun. So oh, yeah, I bet. so oh. good. Yeah. Property foreclosed by order of Madison Enterprises. Ooh. Oh, Madison. This is my favorite novelty store. Ah, the International House of Mojo. Wow. This place hasn't changed in years. Oh, this is so insane Welcome, to see. Welcome, Guy right? Brush Threepwood. Nice to see you again. I have been waiting for you. Oh. You mean ever since we last saw each other? It's been years. You mean... Fate ordained that you would be here several <laughs> minutes ago. Only you can manage to be late, even when you are fated to arrive. It's a gift. Allow me to seek knowledge on your behalf. Will it cost me anything? Pride. Free will. Not much. Stalker. <laughs> Thank you, Ghost Stalker, but I really, I, I've secret. gotten pretty good at it's not like sharing a serpent, secrets. Which swallows itself. Many obstacles lie <laughs> Yes, Atherton Wing, serpent I did work on obstacles. this game. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, no. Hmm. Ooh. You must walk the path. Yet you have already walked the path. And now I'm going back again. <laughs> When you are unsure of the way forward, oh my God, it's a hint this book. book for guidance oh, on I what love this. To I love come. this. It can yeah. tell me my future. In a way, think of it as a book of <laughs> hints. <laughs> what is it really? <laughs> a book of hints. <laughs> 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 it's um. <laughs> the voyage. Neat. Thanks. No charge. Now you must go. I have a luncheon. And your destiny lies at the docks. It does? Most assuredly. Um, okay. So the hint book. I did not work directly on the hint book, but which means that to me it is completely magical. Mm. Like It's just like Alright. Oh, I don't know that you wanna so, get a hint right now. I don't yeah, know sure. that you wanna get a hint, but I will say that like when you get hints, it like it almost feels like it's reading your mind. 
like when so, you get stuck. So I I think that we need to go to the docks and we need to find the yes. So I want to try. I think this. so too. <laughs> I need another hand. <laughs> oh yeah, the little. <laughs> ah. It's <laughs> it's just like guy. so good. Yeah. Now, did I just lose out on an achievement by opening up that hint book? Oh, I hope not. I think your life is richer for seeing the, the work that Kenny did Commerce on the Commerce Midnight Luncheon back shortly. No, totally. I, I, I like the little doodle. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, my God. You know what I like is Note when it's a doodle of a little guy, place. it's like you're Thanks calling him like a little doodle. Cash like a little D-U-D-L-E. <laughs> yeah. -E. Dude, look, look at this area. Oh, nice. No penalty for using hits. That's that's cool. That is cool. Hi. Everybody thinks they know more than the other. Okay. <laughs> Once you have a key, you've got to open the door. Dude, Doodles is a great name for, like, a community that watches a particular streamer. Hey, Doodles! <laughs> Welcome to the Doodles! Mm, that is pretty good. Oh, did I just... Oh, oh, I'm running over the cord that I specifically want to not run over. God. God. That's good because every time we every time we tangent, it just means it gives people more time to like catch up, you know yeah. what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah. Playing the game. Yeah. We like to doodle. Man, speaking of which, <laughs> looks like a volcano <laughs> island with horns that swallowed a basketball. The note says forced to close. Thanks for the memories, but Cash would have Cash would have been better. Hi there, newcomer. Hi. I love the locksmith. At the end of the plank. My mother's. Please don't touch it. I see a peninsula Dude. trailing off into small islands, but no X marks the spot. It's southern Florida. I have family there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like? you know what? That's One second. Hats. Uh, steak face, you revolutionized things. Okay, dudes, yes, dudes is masculine. Dudettes, feminine. Doodles, non-binary. That's oh, incredible. Like, hey, that's doodle. hey, doodle. Hey, doodle. Hey, doodle. Oh, that's good <laughs> shit, man. That, there doodle. it is. Yeah, that's very good. What's are these up? for customers? Hands off. Those are my last crackers. Handsome looking parrot. And also vicious. But it was my mother's favorite. These are nice. It's a locksmithing test. Close it all up, and if you get the key out, you pass? That's the beginner level, yes. The real challenge is to lock the larger box inside the smaller one. <laughs> <laughs> it's so stupid. That's an impressive machine. Yep. This wouldn't be much of a lock shop without a key grinder. I see everyone in that portrait has lovely locks. If you have to make a pun, <laughs> at least make a good one. Basically the Is team that model. from a famous locksmith band or something? <coughs> My mother's band, the Golden Keys. They were named after some actual Golden Keys that she spent a bunch of time looking for. I'm Garbers um, Threepwood. Pleased to meet you. I'm Lock Smith. You're kidding, right? <laughs> nope. And before you ask, yes, they did. Yes, it was. And they really, really wanted me to follow in the family business. <laughs> All right. Can you make keys for stuff? <laughs> can, you can you really make keys for stuff? stuff? That seems like a magic trick. Modern locks have serial numbers that tell me all I need to know. No tricks necessary. Just information. It seems wrong that you can make a key from just the serial number. It's a failsafe, in case people lose their key. You know how people are. Aren't locks way less secure if all you need is a number to get a new key? That's why you should never share the serial number with anyone. <laughs> what happens if you lose your key and the serial number at the same time? The numbers are usually engraved on the locks, just in case. And if you lose the lock, chances are you don't need a new key. <laughs> well, what's to stop me reading the serial number <laughs> on someone else's lock? such a good line. Key made? The numbers are printed small enough that you need a special tool to read them. Only a pro would have a tool like that. Can I borrow your <laughs> lock serial number reading tool? My magnifier? Not a chance. I could be drummed out of the union for that. If you want to play locksmith, you'll have to look elsewhere. Damn. 
<laughs> Tell me again about how to have keys made. It's exciting. <laughs> Who's the old lady in the window across the way? You mean Whitey Bones. She used to be the undertaker here years ago. Seems to know a lot of things that maybe don't quite fit together. <laughs> oh, no. I have a single gnat in this room. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. But don't you have also a single cat? Yeah. I have a pair. But let me tell you, they're both on the heating pad. And they are oh. so asleep, it looks like a crime scene. <laughs> so, I think, oh my based God. on <laughs> using adventure game logic, I think you need to turn up the thermostat. You know, I... I, I mean, they're both just like, oh, like, they don't even look comfortable. They just look... And I can oh. see them breathing, so they're alive, but like, my God. <laughs> all right. How well do you know Whitey Bones? Not well at all. But she's been living near my shop for quite a few years. She was across from my old location, too. But she moved when you moved? I'm sure it's just a coincidence. All right. Interesting. I'm on a quest to find the secret of Monkey Island. Exciting. The story in my family is that the secret is sort of like a key. One that opens all locks at once. All at once? Huh. Well, how does that work? No idea. It's just a story. But I guess you'll find out soon enough. How would you like to join a pirate crew? Would I have to leave my shop? Well, yes, that's the general idea. The crew actually get on the ship and, you know, crew it. Thanks. I'll pass. Try down at the docks. <laughs> There's always somebody hiring somebody down there. I think I'll browse around a bit. Try not to touch anything. I've got a system, and I don't like it disrupted. Um, look at, so look at the display cases again. Just like, yeah. What's this key? That's for a lockable quiver. And What's then just like key? do it again. That one is only for going in. <laughs> there's just never for coming out. There's just What's keys that? and locks in there. That one's for making a quick exit from somewhere you're trapped. What's this lock? It's meant for bachelors to secure their apartments. And he's just and please it's just so guy brush. What's that key? That opens a long straight wardrobe for keeping long straight dresses. <laughs> What's this lock? A special one that can open with any of four different keys. What's this lock? A famous lawyer used that to keep people from stealing his front doormat. <laughs> What's that lock? That's for sealing a container full of evaporated gas. And please, don't touch the glass. What's this key? That activates a mechanical kettle. What's that key? That unlocks your house. What's that key? That one is only for going in, never for coming out. What's this lock? It's for a small jazz band to lock up their gear. What's that lock? A famous lawyer used that to keep people from stealing his front doormat. Oh my god, this is so good. Right? Lee, did you write any of these? I did not write those. But I think that's that's a good, you know what? Yes, let's use this as, as a sort of rule. You can, if you ask me if I wrote something, I will say yes or no, but I won't otherwise call it out. Well, I'm about to become like Guybrush 3. Did you write that line of dialogue? <laughs> Did, you write, Did you write that line of dialogue? What about this line of dialogue? <laughs> Aw, this is where I risked my neck for Elaine, and she showed me she only needed me to risk my heart. Also, the windows need some work. Dude, can I say that, like, humor in an interactive setting is so... I think that is, like, nearly impossibly difficult to do well. Because, like, it's so easy to get frustrated that you can't make progress because that's the whole point mm -hmm. of a game, or it's really easy to kind of max out the slapstick and humor, and, like, you feel like like it's not... There's not, like, a rise and fall to it. There's not a flow. Yeah. If, like, every yep. single sentence is trying to be extremely funny, like, doesn't work. Yeah, um... Things are not there's. There are a lot of jokes in this that I feel are there to sort of lubricate the experience, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like, they're not all trying to bust you up. They're also building a world in which, you know, sort of dad jokes are part of the texture. Sure. <laughs> it yeah. seems to be stuck closed. I've got a few coins for incidentals. The pen is mightier than the sword. Oh yeah, we already did that. The to-do list. Get or find a ship. 
So this this can't open yet. Is there something? Was it just read the sign? Oh, read the sign. Employees only. All right, nice. All right, okay, okay. Going to jail. A visitor. <laughs> Wait. Guybrush Threepwood. <laughs> Otis. Howdy, kid. And Stan. Ah, oh, Stan! Pal. You haven't changed yes. much since I last saw you. I blame the government. In fact, <clears> didn't <throat> we first meet right here? Not at all. I was in the other cell that time. You look different somehow. Uh, new art style? <laughs> oh, nice of you to notice. <laughs> <laughs> Big news. I'm going after the secret of Monkey Island. That sounds fantastic! You know what I remember most about Monkey Island? The time you busted me out of jail right before we went there. I don't <laughs> cruise ships anymore. But maybe you can still help me out. Like you did all those years ago. Possibly, though it was kind of tricky last time. And I didn't get much out of it in the end. I would be most appreciative. A locksmith has opened very conveniently <laughs> across the way. I am told locksmiths can make keys for things. Uh, things like cell doors? Imagine that. <laughs> Spill water all over um, myself. All right. Is the chat allowed to ask me if I worked on a room or? or no, no. It's just, it's just me and Sean. Yeah. Okay. We we can't trust any of these plebeians yeah, right. with with the ability to <laughs> ask questions that can be answered. We like we we don't even answer questions when I'm broadcasting alone because I just don't trust anyone. So I'm going to continue. That makes sense. They get you for this time. I'm a victim of circumstance. <laughs> circumstance wait. being that too much attention gets paid to little things that don't hurt anyone while hard killers roam the streets with pistols and swords. I noticed Sean, you didn't say what crime they locked uh, you up. Now they're all asking yes, if I didn't work on this room. I just picking some flowers. In the forest? Uh, no, that's illegal. I learned my lesson. I picked them from the governor's garden instead. Huh? Hey, Sarah and Jell says, but do you take bribes? Yes, you can bribe an answer out of us for five gifted subs. Like, absolutely, we <laughs> are yeah. pro-corruption on this broadcast. 100%. <laughs> Picking flowers from the governor's garden sounds like an unwise choice. Picking flowers from the governor's garden sounds like an unwise choice. We used to be friends. Sort of. Anyway, they aren't even her flowers. Taxes pay for them. It's public property. I don't know why anyone bothers me about it. I don't hurt anybody. Well, except the flowers. They're annuals. They're doomed anyway. <laughs> I rush out of here. It's custard night. I don't think I can take that again. I'll make it my so number good. three priority. Thanks. I'll make it my number three priority. Watch your boots in here, son. It's like a swamp. Not the clean parts. Arms are so good. It says right? jail rules. Oh One. My no escaping. God. It says jail rules. One, no escaping. This little foot. Hey, Stan. He has Hello a there, son. <laughs> oh, sorry to see you in jail. Thank you, son. I appreciate the thought. I'm sorry to see you <laughs> here as well. <laughs> I was really hoping to buy a Stan's arms are well, back. Normally, I would do absolutely anything to get you into a comfortable ride right away. But my hands are tied. They're shackled. I can't do it. Not at any price. I'm completely out of inventory. Every ship on the lot was seized by unscrupulous lawyers who don't care about your sailing needs the way I do. Oh, that's terrible. Believe me, I feel worse about it than you do. <laughs> Could I get a ship from you after you're out of jail? Don't count on it, son. I expect to be released any time, but I haven't even got anything on back order. It pains me to lose a sail, but if you need to get off this island, you're gonna have to find another way. All right. Could you refer me to a competitor? Stab me in the heart. You'd go to a competitor? Where's your loyalty, son? Well, seeing as you're in jail and have no ships and can't help me, I thought. It doesn't matter anyway. There's no competition. I drove them all out of business long ago. Nobody can play the angles like old Stan. I didn't really anticipate a situation like this one coming up. All right, any tips on how to steal a ship from someone else? Oh, yeah, look at the layers of hints. Any tips on how to steal a ship from someone mm. else? One word, son. Mutiny. Get yourself on board a worthy vessel, gain the confidence of the crew, wait for the right moment, and strike. If you don't get killed, look me up afterwards. I'll give you a good price for anything that can stay above the waterline. Naturally, it'll have to be store credit until I get back on my feet. 
<laughs> the arms and the plaid is so ridiculous. Okay. The plaid, well, right, that is one of my all-time favorite gags. You, let me know. As long as it doesn't I love that every time it comes up. All right. What did you do that got you arrested? Let me tell you something, son. It's not <laughs> what a man does that matters. It's who he is. Maybe one day, in a moment of weakness, he crosses so good. a line. But if he's confident <laughs> about what's in his heart, he can hold his head high. And you know what's in my heart, son? Blood and goopy stuff? People. People are in my heart. Anything I may have allegedly done, you can be sure I did it because I care about people. <laughs> I love that we've been going for a full hour. We, I don't even think we've solved a single puzzle. I've just been sitting here grinning, hitting all the dialogue options, looking yeah. at all the things. No, what I want to know exactly what he allegedly did. You allegedly did you allegedly do for people that got you arrested? I gave them what they wanted. Now, naturally, people don't always know that they want the things they want. Sometimes it takes a man with a talent like mine to show them the way. And sometimes people who are jealous of that sort of talent will try to put all sorts of unpleasant labels on it. They use hurtful words like scam and misrepresentation <laughs> and even fraud. But it's all just marketing, son. As natural as the rocks and the trees and the Malay Island flounder birds. And that's why I'm not worried. I'm awaiting final judgment of the court, but I'm certain I'll be acquitted. They don't hang people for marketing. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you used to have a law practice or something? Used to, but I was disbarred for what we former law practitioners call moral turpitude. Is that a real word? More or less. It's one of those handy <laughs> catch-all words that you can use whatever you want because it doesn't mean anything specific. All right. <laughs> Would it help if I broke you out of jail? Now that's a kind offer. It truly is. Warms me to think that you'd do that for your old pal Stan. But I've got to think about the optics. I don't want to damage my case, and escaping from jail doesn't look good at trial. So thanks, but no thanks. All right. Uh, I'm going after the secret of Monkey Island. The secret? Boy, that takes me back. Yeah. But if you're looking for help, you're barking up the wrong enchilada. Just remember, <laughs> life has no guarantees or warranties. Only jamborees. Thanks. That's... <laughs> Advice. Chamber. Thanks, that's, <laughs> that's advice. advice. <laughs> is there anything else I can do for you? Now that you mention it, there is one thing I've been missing. Nice, during give my me a time task. In this lofty yeah. establishment. In all the rush and fuss and document shredding surrounding my arrest, I completely <laughs> forgot to grab my toothbrush. If you happen to be passing by the shipyard, you might grab it for me. It'll be on my desk in the office. Sure thing. Great, easy. Okay. Are you sure you don't want me to break you out? 115%, son, but thanks. See you later. Yep. Okay, we, we have some tasks. I'm just going to briefly scan the area. How's your day going? <laughs> Was there... I love that it just says that. that rubbed away. Yeah. Ooh, that rat. I think there's some writing on it, but it's too tiny to read. Nice! There's something on the ground you near look like you're Stan a cell? Good time. So, That's nice. Is that making that up? Oh, it's a trivia card. Yeah. Oh, well done. How many named books are there in the mansion bookshelf? Um, I, I, I don't want to risk it. Damn. I, I don't know the answer to that one. No, we got. I gotta hold it. I gotta hold it for a while. I want to all gold. Real prison is the one in your. Head. At least this jail has two lamps. Yeah, we are living the life. At least the jail is. What yeah. So this has a serial number, so we can get a key I made. I think there's some writing. Mm -hmm. So we right now need to a magnifier. Find our own magnifying Stick glass. to the. Okay, yeah. mm okay. Mm uh, Lee, how many times have you played through this game start to finish? Start to finish? Not that many. Um, the testers, however, sure. I think played it through start to finish about 7,000 times. But um, I mostly played each room, uh, you know, thousands of times in succession. Carla. Individually? Yeah, yeah, right. Oh. Oh, yes. Rush Threepwood. Shing. <laughs> Hello, Swordmaster. Pre 
prepare to taste my blade, you washed up hack. Uh. Uh oh. Middle, middle one? Yeah. When was the last time you had a bath? Ha! That was marginally clever. It's nice to see you again. You too. <laughs> God, I love the sword fight play animations. Uh, how's the governorship treating you? It's a very reasonable sure. one. It's, you know. yeah, how's the governorship treating you? It's not as straightforward as I'd hoped. For some reason, you can't just tell everyone what to do and assume <laughs> they'll do it. That's uh. new territory for me. Not for me. Maybe I should be governor. I heard from your wife. She's coming by to talk about scurvy legislation. I assume you're involved with that somehow? Uh, I love watching the people who aren't, you know, former Monkey Island people. Like, hey, Matt Man W2 says, you have to choose between one-liners, question yeah, mark? Yeah, and you have like, to choose the correct oh, one-liner. Yes. Oh, yeah, no, that's, yeah, that's a that, challenge. Yeah. All right. Although this is more of a conversation. Uh, how, how, oh, yeah. Elaine said the program is being hampered by Captain Madison, who hampers everyone. Ooh, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Elaine said that program good. is being hampered by Captain that's Madison. That's a potentially Not productive the legislative line part, of... Just the public funding. The town was in a bind a while back, and that so-and-so Captain Madison saw an opportunity. She lent us the cash we needed, but now we're up a creek paying the interest. Things like social programs, waste management, and town maintenance are all on the back burner. Uh -oh. I like that woman less every minute. You Got a private equity that. pirate, man. Pirate yeah. equity. <laughs> Nobody likes her. I'm looking for the secret of Monkey Island. Good for you. I don't have it. <laughs> I'll be needing a crew. You interested? <laughs> I'd rather swallow a live badger than crew with you oh. again. No offense intended. So Let's see, just ask, but still possible. If this is no, a whole game series. Oh baby. <laughs> oh, you're in for. How? Okay, hold on. Let me let me get my phone. Let me look up Monkey Island. <coughs> the question is, how many games are there? Um, I'm gonna say six if you count the whole season. Yeah. Uh, as one game. Yeah, Otherwise, I thought there was like ten. Eight. I thought there was eight. We're gonna find out. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Media. I, I I do like how this game works for people who are fans and people who are new to oh. the. Uh, yeah. There's seven. The franchise. There's seven. Oh oh wait there's hold on seven? I gotta I gotta open this. This is this is the greatest Monkey Island Wikipedia and let me open up this. Okay let well, me. Well this, this game. Like clearly takes place do like this. immediately after the second, so yeah, no, okay, that so makes sense. But if, if you look at, at at the games, like, look at this, look at this uh, timeline. Nineteen ninety was the Secret of Monkey Island. The ninety one is Monkey Island Two: LeChuck's Revenge, and That's then very quick. Yeah, and then there is a six year gap, and then Curse of Monkey Island comes out, and then there's a three year gap, and then. Wait. There's a 10-year gap. Mm-hmm. Are you guys going full PowerPoint now? And PowerPointing. Yeah, I don't know yeah, what the story is. Uh-oh. Well, that's fine. I know exactly what's happening. Crap. Yeah, no, it's it's because of what I'm doing with the game. But look at this. There's, <laughs> there's a there's a nine-year gap between Escape from Monkey Island in 2000 uh -oh. and then Tales of Monkey Island, Secret of Monkey Island Special Edition, Monkey Island 2, Chuck's Revenge Special Edition, all right, and then Return to Monkey Island 2022. That's amazing. And now when I do so awesome. this, and then do this, we should be fine. Nice. Lost of and... Getting Oh, better. no. All right, hold on. Everyone, everyone chill. Everyone chill for a moment. Let's see if we can it's do this. this. It's a screen of resurrection. That's the sigil. This is so funny. All right, yeah, no, we're good now. All right, so we. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> but dude, like the, the the original Secret of Monkey Island came out in 1990, and then Return to Monkey Island is 2022. That is an mm -hmm. insane gap, man. Fuck, man, that's 32 years. Yeah. Yeah. 
is there a government I'm so program that old. funds expeditions to find mm-hmm. secrets of Monkey Island? Oh gosh. Truly we ancient too we are. Late for that one. We canceled it last year and diverted the funds to build a habitat for the rare Caribbean whining leech. Darn. There's a ship at the docks that's headed for Monkey Island. <laughs> whining leech. I think you're talking about LeChuck's ship. Do you want to go to Monkey Island or don't? You? Dude, that's so funny. Dude Seth says, does this make Monkey Island older than StarCraft? Yeah, StarCraft was released at the end of March in 1998. So Return of Monkey Island was eight years before it. Well, the Wait, only eight back. years? Yeah. Elaine's style is still everywhere. Wow. The, the 90s were pretty wild. Books now. They were, like, games know. and game technology. I don't really have anything yeah. to say. I just like doing this. Practice is nice, but I'm busy these days. Governor stuff. All right, so l- let, me, let me do some stuff. Let me get this trivia card. Oh, hell yeah. Dude, now that I'm looking for them. All right, so how many unique books are here? Endless Tale. Two tricks. There's two on the shelf. Three, four, five, six, seven. Are there any okay. repeats? I don't think so. I'm, I'm willing to lock in. Oops. Let's try it. Yes! Hey! Yeah. You done it. How long does it take to walk to Mon- Monkey Island? To walk to Monkey Island? I'm not. That's interesting phrasing. Oh my huh. gosh. I don't know the answer. Ooh, ten, ooh. ten minutes uh, is how long Guybrush Throughput can hold the breath. I like your stuff, uh, but I don't guess know how long it takes to walk Please to take that and throw it away. It was a gift from the Earl of Thickwater. The Earl of Thickwater. Earl of Thickwater. Oh, Thickwater. Oh, God. <laughs> Do I need to put a content warning on this? Oh. Yikes! Uh. It's a lot of work being governor. It's a lot of work being governor. Damn right. All right. Ugh, <laughs> looks like Carla wasn't too keen on getting her portrait done. That's amazing. <laughs> it's so <laughs> good. <laughs> Such a good gag. <clears throat> Edgy. <laughs> I've always thought this looked like my old ship, the Sea Monkey. <sighs> So cute. Very cute. All right. All right, so can I go up? Stay out of my bedroom, three wood. Oh, hi, kitten. <laughs> I've seen Whoa, that same hi, painting kitten. on a box of frozen instant cereal. <laughs> Elaine told me that's Lauder Neckbeard, second governor of Melee Island. His overly strict morals and overly lax regulatory policies helped make the island what it is today. <laughs> What a good cat. Oh. Oh, I love mouse only games and a cat at the same time. Hell oh, yeah. That's the best combination. It's the old cat and mouse. All right. So, All right. So, let's take back way into the mansion. Oh. Oh man, this map. Oh. Oh my god, I can just walk to here. Oh. Oh, and look at I'm a little paper cutout. That's Needless amazing. polish. Yeah, oh. you're a little guy. Yeah, you're just a Even little man. The museum is gone. So is the cable to his island. That's yeah, just as well, given the worldwide rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle shortage. <laughs> what are you doing? Just a little doing? doodle. Come here. Just a little doodle. There you go. You can rub against that right down there. There you go. All right, uh, and, uh, er, uh, let's go to the forest. You know, I will also shout out the, the this game plays amazingly with a controller as well, which, mm. like, like, you actually, it's got direct drives, so you, like, drive them around. Yeah. Really? And then yeah. you get close to a thing, and it pops up, like, button mm-hmm. options. And you can use your, I think you can use right stick to look at different options. And, uh... And like, as soon as you touch the controller or the mouse, it switches to that one. 
I like that. All right. Yeah, Warning. it's really cool. The dark forest ahead is deadly and twisty. Maps are highly recommended. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. I'm looking for cards. Looking hards for cards. I want every single card in this game. Oh, I used to love these when I was six. Love the eyes there. It's so good. Oh, I used to love these when I was Museum of Pirate Lore. Hell yeah. I will say that. Oh, Lee. there she goes. Oh, no. Oh, Lee? Lee. What happened? Lee, your internet blipped. All right. Well, while Lee is. Uh oh. Oh, no. Uh oh. Quickly, oh, no. Focus oh, on no. me and the cat. Focus on me and the cat. Right. I'm All back. Right, let me get you back here. All right. Nice. Sweet. Hi. Perfect. Yeah, I have to just turn on and off my um, thingy, my thing. I will say this. I was in charge of the forest. Mm. Oh. Yeah. oh. At Chamber of Commerce Midnight Luncheon. Back shortly. Once upon a time, I want a t-shirt right here on the front lawn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, so... I'm gonna I'm gonna go in here because I want to see what Lee Lee worked on. Purple flowers. Ooh, purple flowers. These must be catmint, or wisteria, or sweet rocket. <laughs> a classic specimen of Alata needleus. A carnivorous vascular dicot known for its tasteful coloration, slight wiggle, and loads of tiny, sharp teeth. Wow. Ah. <laughs> I can all think. Mm, purple flowers. These must be teasel, or alliums, or clematis. Purple flowers. <laughs> These must be lavender. <laughs> Or monkshood, <laughs> or cyclamen. Ooh, purple flowers. These must be teasel, or alliums, or clematis. Yeah, I'm pretty proud of that. All right, let me give me a. Sorry, there, there's a, there's a particular thing that I am doing with my, um, ow, with my uh, streaming setup that if that I felt like it told a story, if I click out of the window in a certain way, I'll start dropping yeah. frames. So I just need to turn her thing off, turn it back on. A map. Oh crap! All right, cool. Yeah, Lee, you did that. You sent us back. Yeah, I sent you back. Yeah, that's right. Lee, that was the best experience of my life. Hey, there's Jen. Jen's the uh, producer. Hey, Hi, it's Jen. 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 Hi, Jen. To wall with sword what up? Um, now there's nothing but trees. Forest progress. Hover, hover. Forest hovers in dialogue. I wrote. I mean, there's not that much in there. I think it's just the plants. You did but, all those. Um, I definitely. Did, write the did you write the plant joke that I just laughed at? I wrote. So I wrote the plant jokes, and then a lot of the stuff I wrote, Dave <sighs> went through and punched it up. So it was like it was like I wrote the jokes, and then later in the process, I went back and noticed that they were just funnier. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the real problem of working on a team. Like I, that's why I don't work yeah. with teams. I have to be alone because you know you can always punch it up better. Oh, it's yeah. so good. Wow, it's worse than I imagined. No. And the I know, assets it's of this so establishment sad, right? have been seized to settle a class action lawsuit. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. It says, Tan's previously owned vessels. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Stan's used to be the best place to buy used chips. All right, do we see any cards? I'm <laughs> joking, my jokes. The window's all boarded up, and it's very dark in there. Is that an old toothbrush? Oh, we need that uh, get, toothbrush. get me. Oh, my God. <laughs> the assets of this establishment oh, have been seen to it. settle a class action lawsuit. Love that. I love that immediate. Immediate. I remember we when need these that torches toothbrush. lit up Stan's previously owned vessels like a carnival. Looks like the only available ship on the island right now is LeChuck's. It's a dried up old sea sponge. Stan used this to clean his ships. It's all rusted out now. Stan used this to clean his ships. It's all I want to pick now. it up. I might need to. Um, Are you muted? Test. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I'm muted. Hi, I want to be muted. 
No, I don't know. Yeah, it, it, but yeah, I've been muted to you for a little bit, and that's you know I apologize. Okay. But oh, but just like, to us though. Oh, okay. Th this this bucket we could use yeah. to solve a shard light puzzle. Well, is it? It's like we needed to make oh. some sort of like uh, yeah, carbon we need filter. To <laughs> yeah, we need to. <laughs> we need can to make we, activated charcoal. If only it was an NFT. <sighs> um, can I shout out something David did? Yeah. Sure. This used to be uh, walk such a walk up to the moon. Place. And just like take note of how sick this is. Look at that. It always looks that bigger on this side cool. of the island. Yeah. I mean that's, that's you become the silhouette. That Look at that. It's bigger on this side of the island. I mean that's just unnecessary polish. That's really I'm, good. It's, it's I good. am so horny for unnecessary polish. <clears throat> Cause the thing is that I believe if you polish a lot of stuff, you don't go yeah. from like a B to an A. You go from a B to transcendence. <laughs> like Like look at that shit. <laughs> Striker K O Jason Sean has three wood. I'm getting three wood for this polish, man. <laughs> oh my god. David says unnecessary polish is my middle name. It's true. Yeah. No, I mean this is what we talk about with Disney all the time. So where good. Disney's just like Yeah. How do we make sure that every rail in Disneyland in some way references one of our properties? You know, like yeah. like the, the all all that just like every little thing is thoughtfully cared for. It's one of those things that's so hard to like measure on a balance sheet because it's so right. easy to be like, hey, should we put in time creating a silhouette by the moon? And someone's like, uh, no, we can't do it. We have uh, eighty enemies that we need to like animate and balance. So it's, you know, let's put it on a to do list with with all the other endless P twos that will never be touched again. Those to-do lists. Yeah. So good. Yeah. Um, hey, thanks, Sam Graham. Yeah, Jen Woo! was in charge of uh, mapping out the world of to-dos. <laughs> Creating, making all that happen. Oh, this Did I get maps... choppy again? Did I do the thing? I did do the thing. I'm so curious as to what the thing is, Sean. Fine now. Should be good. Yeah. Yeah. No. We're yeah. Good. I mean, I'll I'll actually show you what it is. So you see how the game is full screen? Yeah. Yes. If I click out, notice that it's a window. You can actually see this oh, up here. Oh, it's yes. windowed. Yeah. So yes. when it's it, when it's windowing, it suddenly needs a bunch more processing to do mm. the rescaling. Yeah. And then um, this can mean that sometimes, yeah. not always, but sometimes when I do that, um, my Computer will be like, oh, I don't know what to prioritize. I'm not going to prioritize anything that makes the stream look good. Yeah, well, I could stare at this forever, but that wouldn't be much fun for you. Oh, but like, oh. so good. Like, really? Like, really? We had, <laughs> like, okay. Heck? When you see an animation like that, it means that, like, it got decided, and then it got specced up, and, like, yep. Jen specced it up. Jen sent oh. it put it in a sprint to go to an animator, the animator really animated good. it, then that, then Jen, Jen had that go to a, a coder who coded it in, and then, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. it, it's just the amount of overhead for Guybrush to warm his hands. Yeah. He, he better appreciate it, you know? Yeah, <laughs> I think he does. <laughs> oh no, Jen did not approve the silhouette. Oh, uh oh, that's true. Uh -oh. It, I don't think it ever, it didn't get specced up. It didn't get specced up as a, uh, I don't know if that'd be a spine animation or a background animation. Okay, so we need to make a ship. <laughs> Wait, wait I think we should go to the ship. Yeah. I think should we go talk to Lachon? I think you're right. Yeah. Look at that. How clever. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Expedition to oh. fabled Monkey Island. Crew positions available. Serve under LeChuck, the most fearsome pirate on the eight seas. Equal opportunity employer. Inquire here. Oh, here I am. Looking for a job? <laughs> Step this way. Oh no. The clipboard no. on your hand says you're the quartermaster. The crew says I'm the quartermaster. Hmm. Clipboard doesn't get a vote. Oh, I'm being stared down you by a skeleton. Like a guy without yeah. many options. You want a job? I'm short of swabby. LeChuck's uh -huh. an equal opportunity employer. 
Even humans are mostly tolerated. Absolutely. Um, you guys, can I can I just say that now the chat is uh, the chat is backseat deving. <laughs> oh yes! No, no, no! So I just, I love that. The ATM, ATM machine says, "Yeah, even scum from around MI2 onwards could handle simple palette changes for character sprites in that fashion." It's like, what is going on? This is the thing. Amazing. Is that like amazing? Like, I, I remember um, having this discussion like a while back, where someone was like, "Hey, what, what's one of the reasons why StarCraft II was able to start with such a strong community?" And it's like, yeah, well, because Warcraft Three and Starcraft 1 had been around for like 12 years, so... Right. You know, when that happens, there's just all this general small knowledge that even people that were semi-interested in RTSs would just glom onto. They were primed and ready, and with this, you have 32 years of people who've been playing scum games and it's LucasArts true. adventure it's games. This, I mean, this is way yeah. more density going on. And of course, as we all know, any backseat devving comment on a YouTube channels comments or on twitch chat it's all right yeah. and they, they know what they're saying yeah yeah art's the first thing to get they're done. never wrong yeah so let's art's the first thing to get done yeah <laughs> i want something more, more senior. senior games are easy well i need a second mate a bosun a ship surgeon and a gunner do you think you're qualified for any of those tabs are spaces and comment styles um Second mate. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> definitely. Be second mate. Do you honestly All right. have any idea what a second mate does? Goes to store openings and funerals and waits for the first mate to be incapacitated? I thought so. <laughs> I'd make a great bosun. Exactly what qualifications have you got for that? I can hold my breath for ten minutes. <laughs> okay, maybe eight. Don't waste my time, okay? How about ship surgeon? I assume you have some kind of medical degree. Is that a definite requirement? Sorry. No, you just you just pitch it as strength. Well, see, that's I, I'm I'm not held down by the way that all surgeons think about it, right? That's right. Yeah. I am oh, I'm yeah, free to think outside the box when I'm cutting someone open for the very first time. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, you can reinvent the wheel. It's 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 very important. I could be the gunner. Oh, I'd be great at that. Boom, boom. You look a little <laughs> scrawny. What do you bench? Bench? No problem. I sat on one for 12 hours once. <laughs> I can take it. I have a lot to do today. Maybe Swabby's not so bad after all. The only requirement is that you bring your own mop. If you've got a mop, the job is... Hey. Hey, wait a minute. What's your name, sailor? Uh... <laughs> Andrew LeChuck, no relation. You got Andrew it. Andrew LeChuck. No relation. What a coincidence. It's a really good choice. <laughs> LeChuck gave me a blacklist and you're on it. In fact, <laughs> you are the blacklist. I'm sorry. Can't hire you. You're obviously Guybrush Threepwood. Well, that's a slight hitch. I'm confused. Didn't you say you were going to get your own ship? Yes, but then suddenly I thought, why bother? I wanted a ship and a crew. Here was a ship and a crew. Ripe for the taking. All I had to do was get on board, wait for the right moment, and strike. Strike? Mutiny the crew, seize the ship. Be a pirate. Yeah. Except they wouldn't hire you because they knew who you were. <laughs> yeah, that was a problem. Also, I needed a mop. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. No parking of demonic, love... ghostly, or undead vessels or scooters. Tuesdays, three to four. <laughs> I love the back of Lechuk's ship. Oh, it's, it's just like just nice. It's it looks yeah, like this it's is gonna be so, a long so red. Ride. Yeah. I hope this isn't one of those party cruises. <laughs> All right, I'm looking. I was um. <clears throat> teaching a uh, virtual production class today and we were looking mm -hmm. at clips of movies that my students are gonna like make previs recreations Expedition in real-time engine Monkey Island. Uh, for and positions available. there's like movies sometimes movies have really good dramatic lighting uh oh, yeah like just like oh, real good serve under 
there's a very red light on the side of somebody's face. Yeah. Uh, Reservoir Dogs have really good lighting. The new Blade oh. Runner has really good light lighting. Oh look, I'm behind the box. Me the this. movie, oh, the yeah. movie Mandy, the movie Mandy has really good oh. flashes I... of color. Mandy looks really, really good, and I'm too afraid to watch it. Why was what? Wally in such a hurry? Isn't it, 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 looks scary. Scary. it looks it is scary. scary. Yeah. It looks I very scary. He Pretty scary. To relieve the pressure upon him in a different way. Oh, let's do it again. I think we're okay. I think we. I think we uh, rode through it. Huh? There we go. Yeah. I did it. All right. The problem is that, like, I can just move my mouse outside the frame, so I keep accidentally minimizing the game. Yeah. Oh, right. I'm going to find a secret of monkey eyes. I actually don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Good I've just been noticing the times when I'm like, mm -hmm, yeah, that makes sense. And I'm like, I have no idea what you're saying. No, that's that's actually a good. That's that's like this is this is corporate and civilization survival mechanisms. Yeah. Right. It's like when you hear a noise, and you just like stop moving if you're in a forest. If someone yeah. says something in a certain tone, you just give an affirmative. Mm, no, absolutely. Yeah, no, hard agree. Bro. Nice. Oh, I can go back here. Yeah, Fuck yeah, it's a screen. Wood. It's a screen. Yeah. Peachy, how's Elaine? She was always my favorite governor. Also, she covered your tab when you stopped coming in. Oh. Still in public service. Fighting scurvy now. My place is clean. Our health certificates are up to date. No, no, it's not like that. She's got a foundation. They're trying to promote limes as a preventative. Oh, well, tell her I say hello. <laughs> Dude, I look at the little maggots. They're so cute. <laughs> They're so cute. Do you know where I can buy a mop? Buy? You don't want to buy a mop. I think I do. The mop <laughs> is the formal tool of a cook. Not as clumsy or random as a dish rag, <laughs> but an elegant tool for a more civilized cleaning. You cannot hope to succeed with the mop of another. I can't? You must construct your own. A single perfect instrument oh that you will God. keep and use for a lifetime. Well, let's hope it doesn't come to that. Once you build it, the mop will become your constant companion, <laughs> your tool, so and a ready means of defense against spills of all kinds. Uh, build it? <sighs> the wood <laughs> is the heart of the handle. The heart is the handle of the cook. You are one. Not helpful so far. You must find a particular tree. A tree uniquely suited to the handles of mops. Carve your handle from a limb of that tree. Any questions? <laughs> <laughs> All right, how do I find it? How do I find the mop handle tree? I can't tell you exactly where it is because <laughs> this is your own personal journey. This game is very straightforward. Remind mm -hmm. me how to find the mop handle tree. I can't tell you exactly where it is. See you later, David. I can't Thanks tell for you exactly where it is Bye, David. because this is your own personal. What kind of wood is the tree? That is something you must. Right. What about the head of the mop? Oh, you have to have one, of course, but pretty much anything will do. <laughs> All right, so we have the stuffed <laughs> animal. <laughs> about the handle. All right. Are you Wait, sure can you I can't use this? just buy a mop? Is that yours, for example? I won't say anything. Oh, you've got we'll see. <laughs> okay. Yes, what's wrong? I, I don't know all the things title. you can use on the thing. It should be you know? called Mob Quest. When do we get to the piratey <laughs> parts? Well, even the coolest professions involve more mopping up than you would think. I, it seemed crazy to me at the time, too. But don't forget, it was all so I could board a ship, take command, and sail to Monkey Island. But first, I had to make a mop. Oh. Active little guys, aren't they? Oh, look at some... Looks like a mugshot. 
<laughs> the Pillsbury Doughboy. It's what, so what good. What is the deal? Okay, what is the deal with that? With the Pillsbury Doughboy guy? Like, Sean, either of you, Sean's, can you shed any light on that? What do you mean? Like, the, the, the picture of the guy who looks like the Pillsbury Doughboy. Yeah, it's, it's incredible. What? I mean, I... I went the whole I went the whole project not really knowing or asking about if it means why, anything. Why or there is why? a picture of somebody who looks like the Pillsbury Doughboy? Well, yeah, because the Pillsbury yes. Doughboy is just a ridiculously stupid mascot for okay. like just cheap purchasable roles. Sure, that you can heat sure. up, and I don't know. It's just yeah. funny to have him framed there. Sure. I, I, that's, what I, that's what I. That's what I. mean, I'm not saying it's. I'm not caught. saying it's not funny. Like I just. I'm not saying. I, like I, I love it. Yeah, I'm just know. wondering if there's more. You know. No, I think. I think that's. I think that's it. Okay. I think that's the whole thing. What do you think, sure? That. Yeah, I like Aww. that his face looks like uh, an emoticon. Oh, that's really. Good. Oh, it's really good. He's, he's having a normal day. That one. That's the normality guy with a hat. It's amazing what you can achieve if you put your mind to it. Then you have a packet of stick-on stars. <laughs> yep, go ahead. Yep, okay. We've, we've lost one earbud. That's good. Wow, I am just noticing and paying attention the to the light says, coming out of, of the... Of yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's really The light really coming good. out of... Yeah. It's so got... it's really oh, super so good. good. All right, all right, here you go. We're, we're going we're gonna to prop you upon the shoulder. I, I, I insist. Come on up. Come on. Oh, also, uh, Sean B., if you'll hmm. pay attention to the music that you can hear coming through the door into the kitchen. I think someone tried like, to secure a boat with this. You can hear the muffled. You can, yeah. Oh, wow. The plaque says, in memory of looming seagulls of old. Oh, nice. All right, sheriff. This is this is quite painful. Yuck. Pests sheriff. or garnishes. A good cook sources local supplies when he can. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we got we got some we got a. Uh, it's good for relieving stress. Got a sponge. We got stuffed animal, <laughs> which is great for the mop head. Mm. Oh, it's hopeless. It's hopeless. We got a pen. Oh. Okay. Um, go ahead and. Okay, go ahead and ow. Okay, good. Ah! Ah! Yep, that's good. That's exactly what I wanted. I, I want to bleed before the show is done. Um, bleed. Good job, Sharon. Sean, you must bleed. Sean. Sean. Find the mop Sharon. handle tree. Okay, so I'm going to exit this kitchen, and I'm going to start asking people about stuff. I do really sure like how everything on our TV list has been crossed out and replaced with a different, more complicated thing. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Actually, never mind. I thought so. Oh, it just occurred to me that this is a guy half hanging out of a window. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. That's, That's a good, good gag. Stupid it's those pain. three clowns at the back table. Oh, look, it's Cobb. <laughs> Hi, Cobb. Hard to believe after all these years, you're still here. I was declared a historical landmark. <laughs> me about Loom. Oh, I'm so <laughs> sick of pirates asking me about Loom. Get lost. Then why don't you take off the ask me about Loom button? My grog riddled body is fused with it. I'm more <laughs> button than man at this point. <laughs> oh, come on. Tell me about Loom. For old time's sake. Beat it. Say it. No. Say it. Fine. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling <laughs> from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic. Stunning, high-resolution 3D landscapes, sophisticated score, and musical effects. Not to mention the detailed animation and special effects, elegant <coughs> point-and-click control of characters, objects, and magic spells. Beat the rush! <laughs> Go out and buy Loom today. Yes. Now get lost. <laughs> oh, look, fan service. Unlock fan service. 
Uh, yeah, the place does seem different from what I remember. It's this new, younger generation of pirate leaders. Oh, they're highfalutin dark magic. Look at us. We're so much better than you because we don't drink grog before getting married. <laughs> These kids today are all about sacking and pillaging. They've got no heart. I'm gonna find the secret of Monkey Island. Wanna come? I heard the secret is just some marketing gimmick Stan thought up. That only the gullible and naive would go looking for it. Nice talking to you. Yeah, yeah. Alright, do we see any other cards in the landscape? Wait, who's Matt Mercer? What? Because Cobb, Cobb voiced by Matt Mercer? I don't know his voice well enough to recognize it. <laughs> really? I mean, I've heard his voice, but I don't know. I, well I, no, I, I, sorry. <laughs> I wasn't saying to you. Green, half Wait off. Wait a minute. Blue, oh my God. Half, half off. Okay. Yellow, half of half of half off. Orange. Wow. Aren't you glad you're here? Nice, nice. It's an unusual <laughs> safe with five keyholes. Alas, That's the so safe cool. is not for sale. It has been placed with me for sale. Oh, and Matt Mercer people. voiced McCree. Oh, I didn't know that. Or whatever McCree's new Pointy. name is or something. It is a non-magical uh, ceremonial it, it, knife. It's, it's something that is just very suburban. It's it's like it's like Ryan Paulson or something. Yeah, Dave, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think I, I think it's it's Howard Johnson is the new name of the character. I want to say. <laughs> Johnson. Yeah, it's Wait, no, it's actually it Holiday Inn. Non magical ceremonial. Um, What's this thing? It's a forgiveness frog. Oh, I love Guybrush no so much. Apology will do. Give the forgiveness frog. It's like a card, only much better because it's a frog. I never heard of that before. <laughs> you sure it's real voodoo? No comment. It works. Trust me. So, I mean, th there's a bunch of, like, entertaining things to click on, but we are post-time. So what we're going to do is we're going to stop, or we're going to look for any cards that are here. Because I love a good oh, pixel Oh, this is hunt. a tough place to look for, uh... It is. For those there's cards. There's stuff on the floor. There is stuff on the floor. I will find every card in this game. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Is this the year when you finally tell me your name? It's become almost a running gag between us. But it's awkward, like when your glass is empty <laughs> but you keep trying to drink out of it over and over. It is Corina. Oh, okay. Corina. Nice. Somehow it was more exciting before I knew that. <laughs> that had so many crazy. conversations like that. All right, hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna back to browsing the shop. I want fast. Supplies are limited. So I'm gonna I'm gonna exit the shop. I'm gonna save it over here, and I'm gonna use this sick oh. new command, which is Alt S, to save. And I'm gonna put us in the Ooh. ninth slot. Nice. And then I can Alt L, and I can just load it. That is so uh, slick. Sweet. Ooh. Wow. That's nice. That's Lee, good. this game rules. Damn, Lee. Damn, It's good, Lee. right? It's pretty good. It's clean, man. It's clean. I'm it's really impressed. impressed. Thank you. That's incredible. Um, yeah, I, uh, I I did work on it. Uh, here, I'm going to just there. I'm gonna turn off the game music for myself. Um. Yeah, this is like so exciting. Like this is uh, this is so fun. I've been imagining for a long time uh, playing through this with you all. So um, my dreams are, are answered or, or came true or, <sighs> or both. The dreams I didn't even think to ask are being answered. Dude, my favorite thing yeah. is is instead of thought crime, yeah. there's thought dreams. Thought there's, dreams. There's dream crimes. <laughs> Yeah. Dream crime. crimes? Dream crime? Yeah, I, I don't really know exactly what the right <laughs> phrase for it is, but I, I, I used my x-ray eyes to peer into your soul and was like, you might enjoy Dream this. Crime. <laughs> so any, so just to be clear, anything that you think someone might like is called a dream crime? <laughs> yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's really... <laughs> That's really the kind of presence that you get for your birthday. Is a bunch of people trying to, to uh, attempt to dream crime you. This definitely is then a very. You better lock me up because this is a really big dream crime. So yeah. Uh, well, that was good. Yeah. I think that we it's we created good. a new word and had a lot of fun. And now that I'm here, I just want to make sure. Is there any? 
cards on this screen. <laughs> oh my god, you've gone card crazy. Now, I do want to point out that, that Jen did say... Yeah, I saw that. You Is have that to right? answer the cards as you go, otherwise they won't appear until you answer the ones you have. Which I did not know. What? Um, and I just wanted to tell you that. But... But I don't know how you would ever... I don't know who... I don't know how to answer that. I don't know I how say, anyone could ever know that. I want to say six months because every other answer is insane. Yeah, like, let me... But where's Monkey Island over here? I mean, it's not on... It's, I mean, it's not on, any, it's, it. it's not on any map. You gotta, you gotta... Yeah, it's not on any map. That's part of the deal. I, I distinctly remember that from the... Uh, from the scrapbook. Oh my what god. What the heck? Whoa. I misclicked. Sean, you're the chosen one. That's the opposite of a misclick. Are Sean. all of them that's correct? A, that's a pro click. No, not all. Are they? Well, I don't know about this one. This one is wild. <laughs> I'm fucking a pro gamer. I'm so good at these games. That's why I play on hard so mode. Can't and lose. Meanwhile, can't lose. all of them are correct, turns out. <laughs> They're all correct. Oh my <laughs> god, that's incredible. Well, I, I I mean this this was a delight, a treat. Uh it was thrilling. And are y'all gonna be free for a few Mondays in a row? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Uh I don't know what else I have from now on. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm I am excited about doing this, I mean, doing more of this. Yeah. After, after, after you're done with school, life just kind of spools out before you, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I guess I guess we're gonna end there. Uh, leave your any right. final words to the the millions of viewers that are tuned in live right now. The millions. Um. Play Monkey Island games. You know, oh, I just yeah. want to say that the only way these games can get made is by monthly donations from viewers like you. So if we make the kind of content that you enjoy, <laughs> just please go to npr.org and get, buy a, get a tote monkey bag island tote bag, yeah. For five dollars a month, and we're gonna put in there oh. an extra monkey for you. <laughs> and that'll help us make the creative, amazing content. None of none of just as a side note, as a disclaimer, all this stuff I just said, made up. Made, <laughs> made up. up. Made up. <laughs> Much like the high quality writing in the game. That was also made up. That was yeah. made up. Yeah, that's. I did learn about game writing. I learned that the first job of a writer is to make stuff up. Yeah. It's a good job. And the second job is to write it down. <laughs> the second job is to write it down. <laughs> if you can do those things... Yeah, and then the third job is somebody else translates it. Right. Amazing. But you don't have call to localization. do that job. Which call is, it localization. I mean, that's, yeah, that's, like, that's the good part. Yeah. Well, we'll be here next Monday continuing Return to Monkey Island, day two. Uh, but for now, yeah. I'm going to go walk my dog. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.